yeah, that Chocobo game, it was a lot to get used to. I had to remember how to do the controls, and I remember always, like, um, messing up on that. But, you know, after getting it down, I finally figured it out. Just tuning in, super hyped for the remake, so trying to get my fix in with the original. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to basically finish the original before the remake comes out. But the fact that it comes out in April is a lot better because I have more time to finish it. And I can, I can actually play more than just FF7. So that's good. But yeah, I'm really excited for the remake too. Gongaga, south of the river. Okay. That's good to know. I think I know what that is. Sick bear it out here. Yeah. The delay, it definitely got me by surprise. And I was definitely, like, disappointed. But I think if they're polishing the game... I don't mind waiting an extra month and playing other stuff is always a good alternative. So yeah, I get exactly what you mean. Are we going to keep these two? I th no, we'll put red 13 in. And Aerith. Aerith Yuffie, I think is a good team. We'll do that. Oh, nice. We got the buggy now. So we can actually go back to Junon, which is... Yeah, we can go back to Junon because we weren't able to do that. I also like Aerith. Okay. Let me... Let me heal up here. Wait, is that, is that sound effect always there? Hold on. I didn't know it did that. It changed the sound effect for the buggy. That's really interesting. Okay. So let me edit some materia since I was using Barret before. So yeah, I think I'm going to go back for Junon for the enemy skill because there was an enemy skill materia there and I forgot it. So I definitely need to go back for that. Hmm. Save our game really quick so we don't have to do any of that again. Alright, so I don't even know how to get back to Junon from here, but you know, I'll figure it out. I think I have to like cross the water, or something like that. I don't even know. Barely know how to use this thing. Hmm. We have to like go around or something. I right, know this leads to Cosmo Canyon. I think I could maybe sail back from Costa del Sol. I think. I'm not sure about that though. I couldn't before, but I'm not sure if I can now. So let me just go back there and try. Because I think enemy skill is definitely a good material to have. Especially when you need to learn, like, a bunch of skills. Alright, so I I can go on the boat from Costa del Sol to um, Junon, is what you're saying? Or do I have to bring the buggy there? I remember trying to 
go back to Junon before and it would let me. So I don't know if I have to take the boat there or the buggy, but I guess I can just go back and figure it out. I need the buggy. All right, that's fair. I can probably figure it out. Oh, wait, I can go here. I think. Yes, there we go. I figured it out. Thank you anyway. All right, so now I just got to go back to... All right, so now I see why you need the buggy. You need it to cross that water. Yeah, there we go. I don't know if I'm able to drive into it. Let me figure that out. I'm not sure. I think I just put it... I just... I guess I assumed I couldn't. But let me try. Oh, you can, yeah. That's a lot better. Yes, I can. I can do that. That's a nice tip to know. Okay. Let's head back to Junon. Yeah. So I need to find how to get this enemy skill materia that I need. That would make sense if um that that's what I would guess if you bring the buggy into the place rather than leaving it behind. I would think it brings you to the other continent. Okay, let's just I have to find this materia. I'm just gonna take a sec to look this up. Just because I really need this skill materia. Oh, in the inn. Respectable inn of Junon. Okay, that's pretty easy. I know exactly where that is. Also, it might be a good time to do some side quests since I have the buggy now. Before going on with the story. Let me just pull out the side quest guide really quick. Helps so much that I have three times speed. I can just rush places. of Junon. Mm. Is this the inn? No, this is a weapon shop. I don't need that, though. Yeah, it, it's a relief that they have the speed and random battles just because, like, for summon animations, you can use the three times speed, especially for FF8. I use it a lot. And the random battles is good when you're trying to backtrack, so, you know. They're good, um, modifiers. Alright. So, this, I don't think this is the end. No. Whoa, I keep going in. Okay. I think the inn is probably next to the weapon shop. This is definitely not the inn. I don't know where I'd get the materia here. Yeah, you were right about the, um, part about the buggy being with me in other continents. So I'm definitely going to try getting used to that. Alright, how are you doing? No? It's still the same, basically? Um, I don't know if this would be it. I don't think this is the end. Okay. I 
I don't know where I'm supposed to get this materia. Okay, no, I don't know. I would assume either where I vest is the end or this is the end, but I don't know. Maybe I can't get it yet, which would be really unfortunate if that was the case. Um, Kudakuma, would you happen to know where to get an enemy skill materia? Because I think there was one in Midgar, but I don't think I can go back there. Or maybe I could, I'm not really sure. Don't remember? Alright, that's fine. Hotel in Junon. Yeah, that's the one I am trying to... Oh, if you go in the upper levels? Yeah, that's the one I was trying to find. Okay, so the Hotel of Junon. Yeah, that's where I am now, so... That's probably the exact one I was looking for. The upper levels. Okay. I'm assuming the upper levels is here. Some of the stores have staircases near the entrance that lead up to additional floors, so it might be sneaky and hidden in one of those. Okay. So is it like where the Shin Shinra soldiers are? Or the actual town? Or am I going the right way? Let me get my guide up for side quest later. Well. All right, I'm just gonna look around. Cause I think it, I think upper levels. Oh, taking the lift, okay. That's what I thought. That's what I thought you meant by upper levels. All right, so I think I can find it now if it's in these um stores. I'm just gonna look through every room of this place. Okay, I think I know what stores you're talking about. Like, this is a store. Ooh, I do like this. You can enter some of the doors along when the parade took where the parade took place. Okay, good to know. I'll probably get there and do that. Right, so these are stores, so... I'm not even gonna bother buying items now. I'll just come back. Alright. Ha. This is a po a mine source. Never mind. So I think a materia is gonna be like something else. It's not gonna look like that. Power source, guard source. All right, very, this is very worth my time with all these items I'm getting. Ah, luck source. All right, all the sources. One thirty one. What the hell did I just get? Shimra armored attack soldiers 12 in the set? Okay, I don't think I've ever gotten that before. But whatever. Okay, I don't think it's in this room. Oh, maybe down here. Nice, I got it. I don't even think I've ever been here.
You don't remember if the um soldier item does anything? Yeah, I don't know. I never got that in my playthrough. I also never been down here. I don't think I ever explored this much in um when I played the game. I explored a good amount, but not this much. Alright, so we got what we needed. Now I have a lot of um I have some enemy skills to catch up on. I don't think I need all of them since not all of them are useful. Alright, so I think we're just gonna go back to Costa del Sol and we'll start um We'll start the side quest. We'll start some side quests just to do. I don't think this is the right way. Alright, take the lift back down. Let's just look around and see if I can get like some enemy skills. So I think, all right, I equipped this to cloud. Let's just see if I can learn some moves here. All right, so we're gonna turn this off. Just gonna just get a few encounters, see if I can. I think they just have to use the move on you to get the enemy skill. Pretty sure that's how it works. Cannot remember. Alright, I found a list of enemy skills. Alright, that's how you do it? Yeah, that's what I thought, because... Yeah, I don't remember ever using a command. Oh, manipulate would help? Let's see if I have one of those. Maybe on, um... Yeah, Kate Sith has one. I figured he would. He... whatever. Um, yeah. Okay, perfect. Alright, so some of the enemy skills I can learn. White Wind, Flamethrower, and Beta. Alright, so the Mithril Mines and find an Arc Dragon. I can do that. I think the Arc Dragon. That's in the Mithril Mines. So we're just going to clear out some of these areas before I go back to the other continent. Alright, turn off this. Alright, these are not Mithril Arc Dragons, so... I'm just gonna kill them. Okay. Cool, cool. Alright, I do want that chest when I get a chance. Like, this is also not the, um, what we're looking for. This could take a while, because I think the Arc Dragon's pretty hard to find in this place. Alright, let me use those sources, actually. Give this to Yuffie. This we're gonna give to Cloud. Guard source also the Cloud. I think that's it. Oh wait, these two. Let me try manipulating. Alright, so that is how it works. I don't think this enemy has anything to give me.
Okay, I get it. So once you manipulate an enemy, you can make them use any attack. So that's probably why it's easier to do enemy skills like that. See, I never, I never really thought about that. I always ignored the um, enemy, the manipulating skill, but I really shouldn't have.